Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Mo P here from beautiful downtown Calgary. And today I'm gonna show you the Mob Mini Spider. So first of all, it comes in pretty cool lunchbox style carrying case here. And I love this thing because it's super portable. So that's the glass base. It does come with a different head. Today I brought my classic Egyptian clay head. Comes with a silicone hose. This is part of the body. Comes with the individual legs. And I'll start setting it up here for you right now. So you just screw the legs in to the base. And then the stem comes in two parts, a top and a bottom. I really like this shisha because it has a diffuser and that diffuser comes off of the stem as well. Mine's a little bit stuck here, but it just threads in and it's super easy to clean. So you go ahead and put the top one in first and don't over tighten anything. Just go till it's snug. Then the bottom one. And then the glass will go like that. And then it comes with a nice little mouthpiece for the hose. And it comes with the strain relief spring as well. Don't forget to put that on the hose before you put it on. And that's it. Other nice little feature with this thing is it has this little stem that sticks up here that you can just hang your tongs onto, or if you just need a place to like put your pipe, you can just stick it on there like that. And that's pretty much it. And um, when you go to fill the water in these, again, just put it so that that diffuser is just into the water. So I'll go ahead and put water in here. I'll pack the head and we'll give this thing a go. All right, so we got this mob mini spider set up. I put a little bit of ice in here, a little bit of water. It's pretty crazy how little water this thing takes. Um, I went and did my signature foil cover here with a little top as well and we we have some fumari white gummy bear in here so i also have my good friend norm here from i am cars make sure you check out his channel and uh he's gonna get this thing going and we're gonna see how easy it is to get this little mob mini spider going so i'm gonna give that to you there's a lot of pressure right off the start here. i gotta <laughs> say i'm like I wasn't expecting that, but we'll, we'll get it going. And just look how easily this thing will fill up with smoke. So I just have one coconut coal on here. Nothing fancy. So a couple other little features um, that for the air flow control. There's no like ball bearing in here. It's just the little rubber flap. So if the smoke gets too harsh or stale and you need to blow it out, there's nothing that you really have to mess around with. Although if you're using it after you've just washed it, um, that rubber flap can stick. So make sure you kind of blow it out before you use it. I think we gotta go on. Yeah? Oh yeah. Yeah, it's smooth, it's really nice. It's super nice with the diffuser too, cause like you don't really get any bubbling noise, but you still get a bit of the sensation. Yeah, it's very quiet. Yeah. Real quiet. But you feel it through the hose, if that right. makes sense. 
So I've had this one for about, I'd say about a year now. And like every time I smoke it, I'm just amazed at like how much smoke you get out of such a small pipe. And it's very smooth. Like I'm, I don't like harsh, heavy, yeah. overbearing feeling that I get from some of the bigger ones. And this one is like really smooth, a really manageable feeling. Mm -hmm. It's not overbearing, you know what I mean? So I like it. I like it a lot actually. The only thing I don't like about it is that it does come with a different sort of painted clay head that they call a funnel, like bowl or a funnel head. And the only reason I don't like those is because it does take a bit longer to get going, but it's not bad by any means. But yeah, that's it, eh? Super smooth, super easy to set up, super portable. It comes in three different sizes as well. This is the smallest, then there's like a little medium one, and then there's a large one as well. And I'm um, like, like I like this one because it's good for tabletops, but then if you don't have a table to sit it on, then it does get a little bit annoying. Um, so I am thinking about getting the bigger one, and if I do get one, I'll do a review for that one as well. But if you're looking for something portable, I would definitely recommend one of these. So, would you get one of these? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, I think so. So he also has the mob, like, little box hookah. And how would you compare that to this? Um, in terms of actual smoke, I think this is smoother. Yeah? I do think it's smoother. It's there less build up to actually come out of the device right so that can be overbearing but i still find that better than most of like the big ones right but this is by far the smoothest one i've ever used like anytime you have this i'm like oh, yeah. yeah i'm like all right yeah because one night we smoked this and we also smoked like the regular khalil mamun like classic egyptian hookah and as soon as like we set this one up after, you're like automatically, this one's way better. Yeah, I was like, oh yeah, thank, thank you. So yeah, if you're in the market for something small, definitely recommend it. And I'll put the link for one of these in the bio as well. I got mine locally from Cowboy Smoke Shop here in Calgary, um, but they are available online as well. So if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, leave some comments below. If you have any questions, definitely leave them in the comments and I will answer them. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Peace.